This presentation is to tell you a little bit about the law courses that we offer at Wilberforce College. We have two law courses. We have the A-level course, which is all exam, no coursework, and the BTEC applied law course, which is part coursework, part external exam. Both of these are two year courses. So to focus first of all on the law A level, in year one, we will start off by looking at the legal system. So we will look at the courts within the legal system, the civil courts, the criminal courts, the people that work within those courts, such as the judges, the solicitors, the barristers, and the lay people within the justice system, the magistrates and juries. We'll then move on to lawmaking. So we will look at how parliament makes laws and how judges interpret those statutes through statutory interpretation. One of the main parts of the first year is the study of criminal law. In criminal law, we will look at fatal offences against the person. So this comprises murder and manslaughter and non-fatal offences against the person, assault and battery, ABH and GBH. We will also look at property offences such as theft, robbery and burglary, as well as potential defences to all of these offences. In the second year course, we start off by looking at tort law. Part of this is the study of negligence. We also look at vicarious liability, nuisance and occupier's liability. After tort law, we move on to human rights law and we will study the European Convention on Human Rights as well as the European Court of Human Rights. We will focus on specific articles of the European Convention on Human Rights, such as Article 5, which is the right to liberty and security, Article 6, the right to a fair trial, and Article 10, the right to freedom of speech and expression. Obviously, these can give rise to lots of debate within the class because these are very topical issues. Here we have a breakdown of how the A-level law is assessed. So as you can see there, we've got three papers. These are assessed at the end of two years, three two-hour exams with a combination of knowledge questions, problem questions and evaluation questions. In A-level law, we do have an excellent pass rate, 100% pass rate for the past three years. In BTEC Applied Law, the National Extended Certificate, we have a combination of examination, that's externally assessed, and internally assessed components. So the externally assessed component, first of all, in Unit 1, will focus on the civil courts whereas Unit 2, the coursework component, will focus on the criminal court system. So magistrates, juries, sentencing, as well as non-fatal offences against the person. In Year 2, we will look at fatal offences against the person, murder, manslaughter, and offences against property in the externally assessed unit. So you would be examined on that area of law. Whereas unit four is internally assessed and this focuses on family law. So aspects of divorce, cohabitation and matters involving children. And again, here we have a breakdown of the qualification. So you've got four units to be completed in two years. Year one, an externally assessed unit and an internally assessed unit. And the same again in year two. In law, we like to go on visits, obviously that's subject to COVID, but we will normally visit the law courts in Hull. So we'll go to the Magistrates Court and also Hull Crown Court. We have also been to the National Justice Museum in Nottingham, where the students took on the part of barristers and took part in a mock trial. 
Last year, we visited the whole University of Sixth Form Law Conference, where our first year students won prizes for their magnificent contributions to plea and mitigation activities and client interviewing activities. If you are interested in a career in law, then why not get involved in the Wilberforce College Debating Society? And lastly, even if you're not thinking that you want to pursue law as a career, have a look at where our recent A-level students have, have gone on to study. So a lot of them do go on to study law, but we have had law students that have gone on to study archaeology and history, maths, law with criminology. And also, recent BTEC law students have gone on to study a very, very wide range of degrees, as you can see there. If you would like further information on studying law at Wilberforce College, please do email me. My email is se at wilberforce.ac.uk. My name is Sonia Evans. Thank you very much.